Hey YouTubers, welcome back to another episode here on ESGNnet of uh, MLB 15, the show here on the PS4. This is Road to Show with Simon Unger. This is episode 105, and we are getting ready for this series here coming up against the Chicago White Sox. It's a three-game series here to start off the new week, and there you see we have an eight-game lead over the, uh, looks like uh, the... Uh, Arizona Diamondbacks there in the uh, NL West, and of course uh, we're going to uh, go to the uh, South Side of Chicago to face off against the Chicago White Sox. This is an interleague game here in towards the end of the, end of the season here. Now, as you take a look here, we got 886 points that we're going to use here, and we're going to try to put these on some areas here that we want to work on. I kind of want to work on one side of the plate, and that one side is going to be the right side of the plate, uh, which we haven't seen him do too much here. Of course, he is a switch hitter, and uh, we kind of want to see what he can do, uh, you know, on both sides of the plate. But I want to really focus in on right-handed pitching because that's, of course, that's what we're going to see uh, more often, um, nonetheless. But there you see here some of his career numbers right there. You guys can take a look at those, pause the video, and check those out. But there you see a beautiful evening here in this sale here at US Cellar here in Chicago and I've actually been to this stadium before uh, very nice stadium um, and uh, I will say it's it, you know anytime you see you know a stadium on television it's like oh man that stadium looks huge but that park is very very small <laughs> um, so yeah it's it, it's pretty small pretty small stadium but all an awesome stadium nonetheless so there you see Chris Sells will be taking on against him of course uh, you know, we've, uh, Simon's taken on Chris Sales before, uh, but the numbers, uh, favor more sales than it does on Simon. So top of the first here with one out with the runner on board here. Simon will hit this one high and deep. This is going to go out to deep center field and that ball is gone. Nice job there from Simon Unger as he hits a home run. That's home run number 55 for him for the season. And that puts him on the board here. With the first two runs of the ball game, there you see, yeah, two RBI home run there for Simon Unger as he is that one sky high deep in the deepest part of the park there in center field. So nice job there. He puts him on the board here now, two nothing here, now four nothing here. Top of the third here, Unger's up to bat again. He'll have get that one. That one will get snagged there by the second baseman and will be thrown out there at first. So nice hustle there from Unger. But Walker does an even better job there on holding on to that ball. So we'll see here the replay. Nice hustle there. Just throwing it from his knee there and getting that ball to first base. As you see, Chris Sells is very happy to see Unger thrown out at first. Now top of the fourth now. 6 nothing now. The Dodgers lead it here. Runs on first and second. This is going to be a pop-up right up the middle there as Flowers gets underneath that one. And, ooh. Don't want to get in his way. You'll end up getting uh, uh, player interference there. But Unger, he'll pop that one up straight up the elevator shaft. And uh, Flowers will get underneath that one and catch that one. So not what you want to see from your slugger here in the late part of the game. Top of the fifth now, 9 nothing now. The Dodgers lead it here. Runner on second with two outs. We'll see what Unger could do here. Hopefully knock in this run. We'll see here. That one's going to get a ground ball there. That's going to be a routine play. Two third, and yeah, that's gonna be it out there. As Unger just says, "Hey, I got here before before the ball did," but apparently that's not the case. Top of the seventh now, bases are loaded here. Unger's gonna try to rip that one. To, he does. That one gets past the second baseman. That's gonna score now two runs. Now he's gonna get a double. Nice job there, sliding double there for him and two RBIs. As he'll get 72 points for that effort there in that at bat. So that's now two hits in this ball game here that uh, he has now successfully uh, done his job here and bringing home a run or in this case two runs top of the ninth now 11 nothing now the Dodgers lead here and that's gonna be a drop third strike he's gonna get thrown out there at first and that right there will wrap up his day as the uh, White Sox are trying to come back but they only are able to scrape up a run as Clayton Kershaw gets his 19th win and Sells will get his 13th loss there. You see two for six there for Unger with his uh, 55th home run of the season. Two, uh, four, yeah, four RBIs, uh, a double, 
and a strikeout there in the ball game. And he is named player of the game. So congrats to Simon as he takes that home, that award there. As uh, he just did, really did some damage there early, hitting that two-run shot there in deep center field there. And that one, yeah, going right over the wall. So Ryu is going to be up the uh, pitch here, 15-4 and four record for him. Of course, uh, now we're taking a look at a spotlight video here of Simon Unger talking about his four RBIs that he had in that in the, uh, excuse me in, the, in that game alone there. So we'll see what he can do here in this uh, effort here against the White Sox here in game two of this three-game series here against them. So four RBIs just a night before. Of course, we'll like to see if he can do that. Uh, but, of course, uh, if you guys don't know, if you uh, played or have seen these road shows, uh, not just mine but others, a lot of us uh, call this video the video of death because usually uh, you have a tough time trying to uh, perform or trying to come back and have a good game after you've seen that video. So we'll see what he can do here as there you see a five-game hitting streak there, 6 of 20 there, hitting 300 right now, and uh, kind of dipping there some as uh, he's kind of been up and down when it comes to batting. Top of the first here, nobody on board. Two outs. Unger slaps that one. He find his, finds a gap out there to left center field. That's going to bounce off the wall, and that will get him a double there. Nice job as he is getting his, himself set up here for his teammate, that being Yasui Puig, to uh, knock him in here with hopefully just with one swing. As we'll see here, nice job there from him. Unger. Again, finding that gap. All right, so here we go. We're going to see him do some base running here. We'll occasionally show you guys some base running here because we actually have his uh, steals now up now uh, where he can actually steal base. But there you see Puig, he'll strike out there, and that will be ending the side there. So now top or yeah, top of the fourth now, uh, White Sox lead it by one nothing. We'll see here 1-0 pitch here for Unger. This one's going to get popped up there. He'll get underneath that one, and unfortunately, that right there will be a pop out, and that will end his uh, at bat there for this uh, second at bat here in this game. So, here you see pitcher very happy to see Unger not on board there. He now, top of the six here. This is going to be a fly out there, out there deep. Oh, that one goes over the wall, head over the left fielder there. Thought it was going to be a fly out, but there you see Unger, he'll get in there, he'll actually get a double again and get an RBI. So, nice job there. Putting him on the board there as uh, Ethier gets in there. And Unger is sitting there at second now waiting for his turn to come home. Top of the six here. We'll see base running here. And we'll see a slide and nice steal right there. He will steal third. And there you get a good jump there. As we'll take a look here. Man, no shot really at him. Trying to get there. And, uh, yeah, he got there way before the tag. Top of the six still. Bases are loaded now. We'll see here. This is going to be a chopper right there in front of the plate. And there you see. Nice pitch right there. Nice throw there from the pitcher to get the runner out. And that will end the inning. So no score there. Uh, and uh, tied now 2-2. Now top of the seventh now. Down by a run here against the White Sox. Runner on third here. We'll see if Unger can knock this run in. This goes sky high. This is going to go deep out to left. And this one. Will be an easy catch there. As yeah, that sacrifice fly not going to work as that gets the third out. And that will change the side here in this inning. So we'll see the replay. Nice catch right there from the left fielder. And look at the pitcher. He's ecstatic. So now top of the ninth now. Uh, still down by a run here. Two outs. No way on board here. And that's going to be a drop. Third strike. We've been seeing that quite often here as Unger will get thrown out there at first and that will be the ball game so final score three to two Dodgers lose that one as Unger two for five in that ball game with two doubles an RBI and a strikeout they win this uh, White Sox win this one and take game two of this three game series here a uh, interleague series here late in the season here against the White Sox. So White Sox do a great job there. Of course, the bad guys, that being the Dodgers there, will have to come back here tomorrow and see what they can do here against the Southside crew of Chicago. So Soria, there you see him. He'll pick up a save there 
in this ball game. We'll see the numbers here in just a bit, but there you see the numbers. Ryu just been uh, struggling here quite a bit now. Uh, here in some of the some of these episodes of Road Show here, he's been struggling quite often, and uh, hopefully that will turn around here as we get closer and closer to the uh, playoffs here. Now, so game three now. There you see the records there, 86 and 56. There you see the White Sox, 62 and 80. We'll see we'll hear what we can do here for ourselves. As Mark Garza will be on the mound there for us. John Danks, 27 starts, 11 and 10 record there. We'll see what he can do, uh, see what Simon can do against him. There you see Simon's numbers there. Top of the first, nobody on board, and two outs here. Unger will swing, and that one will be a ground ball there, a drop ball there from the third baseman, but he picks up the ball in time to throw him out there at first as we're still doubling our points there. We've got 21 points there for that effort there. Now uh, you see 0-1 now for Unger. Ground out back in the first here, top of the fourth here. Run at first and second. Nice job finding a gap out there. That right there is going to score in a run. Possibly two. Unger going to try to go for three, but he decides to stay with a double. And two runs will score there. As you'll see there, two RBI double there for Unger. So he is now sitting at second here, waiting for Puig to knock him in and try to extend this lead here early in this ball game. Two nothing now, top of the fourth here. Unger at second here. We'll see what Puig can do. Unger really thinking about stealing, but yeah, he'll get picked off there. And that'll be his first time being picked off there at second. Top of the six now, 3 nothing here. Nobody on board. Two outs. And again, he will swing and a miss. I have to try to run to first, but he will get thrown out there at first base. So now, 3 nothing now. Dodgers lead it here now. 4-3 now. Top of the ninth here. Unger trying to get this one. We'll try to get this win for his team here. That one will get skied out there. That one's going to go deep and out to left center field there. That one will get caught. And that right there will retire Unger for the day. So hopefully the Dodgers can hold on to this lead here and try to win this game here. And we'll see here. Now we're going to go to extra innings here. Top of the 11th here. Runner on first with two outs. Unger has the opportunity here to try to get, get this game won. He'll hit this one high and deep. But is it deep enough to go out of the ballpark? Will it go to the warning track? And it does. As that one goes to the warning track there. Nice catch there from the center fielder. And it's still tied up. But the White Sox will come back in the extra frame and win this one 5-4. As Unger is 1-5 for five for the day with a two with a two RBIs, a double, and a strikeout. His average now at two or excuse me, at 380. So there you'll see here we got some extra points there we're going to use towards uh, some areas there in this game, especially for his batting here. But uh, Dodgers not too good in that series there as they lose two of three there. And now had have to uh, get ready to head back home here after a day off and have a series here, uh, actually a homestead here, uh, against the Diamondbacks and the Padres. First up, the Padres. As you see here, uh, Padres 18 games out of first place now and there you see Arizona five and a half games out of first place so right now actually Arizona's on a pretty good winning streak here and uh, we got to try, try to slow them down here uh, as soon as we get ready to play them but that is it for this episode you guys as uh, you see there's the next episode the next episode will be those uh, two series there the uh, Padres and the Diamondbacks so definitely come on back as we are just uh, weeks away well, I got what I got two weeks left until the end of the season so we'll see uh, what Unger can do right now if I'm not mistaken I think we've already clinched the, the division so we don't have to worry about the division we are in the playoffs now so um, everything looks pretty good right now so if you guys enjoy the video please leave a like also if you're new to the channel please subscribe and check out uh, other great series here on ESGN net not to mention you guys can follow us on social media on Facebook Twitter and Tumblr links are down below in the description and as always keep yourselves healthy and I will see you guys next time.